very much. Uh, that was the Aquatic Centre. Well, this park is huge uh, and Kate has got herself a great vantage point and we can join her there for a check on the weather. Kate, how's it looking? It's looking pretty good up here, actually. You can see behind me the Olympic Park. The weather, the sky isn't actually that much different than it was this time 10 years ago. We had quite a bit of clouds, some few showers in the morning on that day, and also one or two in the evening. Now, if you look at the satellite picture from today, you can see that we have had quite a bit of cloud. One or two showers first thing this morning. They were very light, though, and barely noticeable. They dissolved. Only about an hour ago here, actually, we had one or two spots of rain. The cloud is quite thick. A few brighter spells, but that's about it. Now, back in 2012, the temperature got up to 25 Celsius. Today here, it was around 21 or 22. Now, into this evening overnight, we've still got this cloud. It's going to stay with us really throughout. Maybe one or two breaks in it. The minimum temperature dropping down to perhaps somewhere between 13 and 15 Celsius. So not quite as cold as last night, although up here it is feeling pretty chilly in the wind now as we head into tomorrow morning we've got quite a bit of cloud around as well but the cloud breaking a little more significantly tomorrow we'll get a few bright spells some sunny spells high pressure is still in charge it's going to be another dry day temperatures just sneaking up a little bit tomorrow we're looking at a maximum of around 24 celsius as we head towards the evening one or two breaks in the cloud later on today as well uh, tomorrow rather so we should see a bit of sunshine before it sets now overnight thursday into friday the high pressure just slides away a little bit low pressure starts to develop to the north of the uk and you can see the fronts coming in from the atlantic but we've still got the influence of the high so it's going to block those for us it doesn't really mean too much we won't see any significant rain anyway on that front we will get a bright start on friday morning we should get some sunshine but a patchy cloud in the afternoon and you can see through the outlook there really isn't any significant rain in the forecast the temperature remains very similar as well for the next few days now as we head towards friday it is going to be a bit warmer. There's a bit more sunshine. And despite on the outlook, it says it's going to be largely cloudy. It's looking likely through the weekend. The cloud is going to break. It'll stay dry and temperatures a little bit warmer. But like I said, still no significant rain in the forecast. Back to you, Riz. Thanks very much, Kate. And that's all from us here at the Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park on this, at the 10th anniversary of the start of the London Games. We've much more on our website, uh, including more analysis of the legacy and promises made. But we also asked you for your memories of 2012. So let me leave you tonight with some of those images from a summer like no other here in the capital. From me and everyone on the team, thanks very much for watching. Bye-bye.